forgot to ask you about the peace pipe. Oh, I'm sorry, I mean the ceremonial pipe. Could you just quickly say a few words about that? Yeah. Well, the, um, there's a misconception again with Hollywood how they uh, portray our ceremonial pipe as a peace pipe. Uh huh. Even though, yes, they um, used to, different tribes that were at war with each other will come together to uh, speak of wars or what they could do to resolve the problems so they stopped bickering between the tribes and they used to come to smoke the pipe. Uh, while they were smoking the pipe, there was no lies, there was no, you know, uh, misconceptions or dishonesty. When we smoked, the, our prayers and thoughts will rise with the smoke from the pipe and it will go straight up to the Creator. Um, but to us was uh, a thing to bring people together or when you were smoking in ceremony, which I can't speak about. But uh, yeah, the word peace pipe came from Hollywood, considering, you know, how the pipe was, oh, was okay. thrown to our people. And, uh, and also the way they portray women in, the, in, in Hollywood. I, I just thought they were like property or something like that. So well, you totally... the word squaw... Oh. Yeah? <laughs> is a very uh, bad word. It's almost like the B word or the C word. Really? That's in exactly American what language. it is. And it was very derogatory to say to an Indian woman. Nowadays, if you say that to an Indian woman, you might get smacked, stabbed, you know, who knows, because it's very bad. Really? And Hollywood used to say it like, you know, just roll it off the tongue, you know, squaw. It's, it's a very bad word. Derogatory. Like, meaning, right. It's oh, wow. Meaning. Well, thank you for that. Let's, let's, um, if you don't mind, may we show a little bit of your home? Yes. Oh, absolutely. okay. So this is the living room. And um, everywhere I look, everywhere I look, there are all these nooks and crannies, these, uh, uh, what, what would I call them? Just symbols and... Uh, and it's art. Representation it's art. Of the yeah, culture. representation of representations of the culture. So here uh, we uh, we have all these. Oh, look at this. This is beautiful. Spirit and come this way. Now we're. Oh, look at this. So these are these are dream what, dream catchers. Okay. Oh, and I love this. Look at this. This is beautiful. And of course the drum. Coming to the kitchen. Fish. And we've got these uh, plates here. And then we have some tapestries. Oh, what is this about? This image here. What is this about? It's like a, a wolf? It's, well, it's what we call the animal spirit. Uh, oh. We believe that in us, we have, uh, some people carry animal spirits. Some so, people and not others? Well, it depends how much you're in touch with yourself, your body, your mind, your temple, oh. you know, your soul. But um, this is like animals, like the wolf, are so much like us because we're without nature and without certain things, we couldn't survive. So. It, you could look at it, the wolf, as a human, or you could look at it as a human to a wolf. I see. I mean, there are legends where there are shapeshifters, where our ancestors used to have the ability to shapeshift and sort of get away from danger. Is that really? Mm -hmm. That's that's a, that's true. Yeah, and uh, this is why we try to keep our home native as possible, so to speak. So we teach our son and uh, the people who walk in here. We're not just weekend Indians. We're Indians. No, you're uh, not you know, weekend what Indians. What we call, uh, we are considered uh, what they call concrete natives. Concrete we live in a concrete city. Natives. Uh, oh, we don't live in the woods or urban Indians. Oh, okay. And some native people carry traditionally their hair the way I have it. Other people don't have long hair, you know. But we work in every part of the economy from lawyers to right, doctors. Right, it's not just construction people. Right, and then we have those people that are strictly devoted to the old ways, to ah. the language, the culture, the songs, dance. So, so these, these, this is not going to die, right? No, these cultures no, are not going to die. No, it's like my eight-year-old, he dances with us, he drums oh. with us. Um, oh, I love that. You know, we try not to push it to him because usually when you push something on a child, they they in turn to back right, off. Right. So we just take him and if he wants to dance, he can dance. We don't force him to dance. If he wants to sit on a drum, he drums. 
And recently he's been really getting into, oh dad, I want to drum and he's getting better. Practice oh, makes, good. You know, because yeah. this doesn't come overnight. You, This is years of practice. Oh, and I love that. years of continuum. I love the way you're, you're bringing up your son. That's mm -hmm. beautiful. Could I just show a little bit more, please, over here? I, I can't help it, but I have to show you the bathroom. <laughs> okay, this way. Mm -hmm. Look. Oh, we need this, the light? There's a, oh, let me put the light on. There's a dream catcher down here. And then look at this. I just love these little figurines. That's adorable. You've got cats, and you've got rabbits, you've got an owl, and then a TP symbol with the with the wolf. And then over here, look who's holding the the towel. A bear is holding the towel. And oh, and, and then you've got all these images. Look, look at how, how lovely that is. I, I I just love oh and come down here and look at the look at the toothbrush and and look who who's holding the toothbrushes over here I mean this is like so funny and uh, and then you've got some beautiful shells oh and down here again holding the uh, paper the toilet paper <laughs> okay and oh and over here you've got the uh, well the hair blower and then you've got a, a rug hanging here. Very, very, oh, and, and look, there's a power magazine if you're sitting on, on the seat, you know, you can <laughs> check that out. And, um, oh, look at all the awards or, or uh, what do you call them, certificates. Um, Robert, Robert, yes. come here, please. Could you quickly say a word about your uh, certificates here? Oh, my certificates. Well, yeah. um... Always look to better, better ourselves. You know, it's always. Uh, oh, is, can we put a light on? Uh, there is no light in this. Oh, room. should I oh. shut this one off or well, not? Well, I'm gonna cut. Oh, this was given to Margie for the help and all the lead work that she does mm. to appreciate, mm -hmm. you know, the mm -hmm. things that we do and everything. Uh, we also got a certificate from the Boy Scouts. I used to be a Cub Master, and we, oh. um, I was actually a Cub Master that was uh, first handing out. Uh, Indian badges for the Oh, okay. Uh huh. And uh, you know, declarations from Senator Lands and stuff for Red Storm and the FEMA uh, diplomas were things that I I've you know worked hard for. We have um, building and managing volunteers. This was for all tribes. It's uh, b rebuilding uh, partnerships with tribes. Oh, uh, excellent. Uh, manage maintaining and social leadership. Uh, what's the other one? Animal. So you've been recognized disasters. In for many, many things. Yeah, I'm more. also going for my rehabilitation oh. license because I like the field that I'm in. Uh, Which is animal care and control officer. Oh. And I want to expand my my career in that because I mean not just because I'm Native American, I get a bit longer with animals, but I figure that. That field is my calling, so, mm -hmm. you know, between the stuff that we do for Native Americans, like for Red Storm, I also enjoy doing that. Well, and, and I was saying, I, I've done he a healing, Reiki healing on animals, and, and uh, we'll have to talk about that. That yeah. sounds like a great possibility. And, <laughs> there you <are>, look. <laughs> what? Uh, <laughs> what? There he is. Uh, <laughs> there he is. There he is. Okay, okay. a quick span yeah. over here and we're done. Thank you so okay, much. Okay, not a problem. Thank you. Enjoy the house. Oh, okay.
You would like that, wouldn't you? Can you picture that? Really? Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's pretty hair on your dad's stick. Why is it blonde? <laughs> We gotta get to the doctors. Yeah, um, yeah. I, I'll just find my way home. Don't worry.